Dobro jutro, which is good morning in Slovenian. Um, we are here at, in Slovenia, walking towards a market. And the light is terrible. However, we just had lunch. And we were really scared because the food here looks suspicious. But it was really good. It was like I ate a pasta that was even better than the one that I ate in Italy. Than some of the pastas that I ate in Italy. So it's like comfort food, which was good. Um, I'm gonna be vlogging through the beautiful views that we already saw some, like mountains with lakes that are just stunning. Um, so, so yeah, so yeah. We are at Bohinj, a lake that honestly looks like a beach a little bit. So, so pretty. Um, after this, we're gonna go to, to Bled Lake. And the lakes here are just, wow. It feels like I just came in and got into a camp. Like, this is camp's vibe, but it's really pretty camp's vibe. bridge that I can't I'm gonna show the outside but it's literally the cutest thing like biking around here with this beautiful lake like it's so pretty I I like Slovenia I didn't know And don't let me fool you because I am wearing pants and long sleeves, but it's actually pretty hot when we're not in the sun. Like, like I was sweating a lot, but tomorrow I think we're going to come back to the lake that we were just now in and we're going to swim in it. See, it's very sunny, but I woke up today and it was cold, but in the sun, it's really hot. So it's worth going inside the the waters for because it's definitely going to be a refresh. Lake Bled. I wonder if Bled means something in Slovenian. Uh, I just don't think it's like Bled like blood. I hope it's not. Because of the sun, the sun is against again, it's again, it's against the, the river. You can't see that this one is like prettier than what was it called the other one Berinj. whatever the lake that we were in before i'm gonna put that type that somewhere it was like this lake blood is prettier but the sun is again so you can't see that it's prettier main food here is pork um sausage that kind of thing so we're gonna eat, we're gonna eat a burger. Um, so, hopefully it's good. So, Lake Bled is like more chung. It's like more, wow, look at that. And the other lake, which I can't remember the name because it's hard to pronounce, um, is more calm, more tranquil, which is why tomorrow we're gonna go back to that lake. Cause then we can like lay down there it's more chill, it's more calm, peaceful, less people. So we're gonna go there to chill. So we've seen both lakes and tomorrow we're gonna decide which one we're really gonna stay at. And right now we're gonna go to the center of Ljubljana, which we're gonna discover what it looks like. But apparently there's a lot to look at there. So we're gonna go both today and tomorrow. We're like doing everything tomorrow, but enjoying it more and chilling more. We also didn't get a good sun, like the sun is there and so the lighting is terrible and tomorrow when it's early, the sun is going to be just about there or up there and then the view is going to be 
way better. Dobro Yutro. Today I'm going out very... Beachy vibes. Walking on the streets vibes. Uh, I... We were kind of super productive today, right, Eves? But we're leaving... We're leaving at like 10, 15 because our parents woke up. We couldn't, they couldn't get out of bed. Uh, but I... I was, I woke up, I changed immediately. I got the rack and I took off the, the now dry clothes off the rack. I then got the wet clothes from the laundry I, that was clean. I put it in the rack. Then I, well, actually my sister started folding the stuff, but we folded the stuff. Then we, we put, we separated whose clothes was each, then um, I began to make bacon, but my sister proceeded to finish doing the bacon. Um, actually she did like the whole thing. Set the table. And then we ate. Now I got ready and now we're leaving. Um, but now I know. I just, I forgot. Like I didn't do this today because I wanted to sleep for as much as I could. But when I actually need my whole family to like, like wake up at 8. Let's wake up at 8. No, I actually have to wake up at 7.30 so that I can wake up everyone because everyone takes 30 minutes to get out of bed. But great. Since yesterday, I began to take headphones because I I just bought these. And they're like, they're not a brand or anything. I just wanted headphones because I lost, my AirPods broke. I got these headphones because the views on the... Like, going anywhere, the view is so pretty with the mountains and everything. And I got these headphones as, like, um, a wind-canceling. And so I'll stick my head out the window, and then the wind won't go, go to my ears. And I can also listen to music at the same time. So this is a tip. <laughs> you guys see how it's super sunny out? In the shade. Super. I mean, not super, but it's cold. Like, I can't keep wearing this. If it's gonna be like this the whole time. But in the sun, how's it like in the sun? It's really hot. Not that. Hot. It's really hot. It's, like way less it's hot. really hot. Way less hot. And than I look pale, so I'm gonna go back and put some blush. <laughs> Before I forget, I just wanted to say that we parked a lit, like we're going on a walk. Um, it's not very long though. And we parked a little a little further away from like bled but we're only paying like an euro per hour well if you park right in front of it you will end up paying 20 euros minimum and then so the tip is to find a parking spot just a little further away and then you go on a little walk but whatever is that fine We're gonna rent a boat, but you can also rent a kayak or you can go to the playing thing. These are the boats, that's the little playground, and these are the kayaks. <laughs> so the men are being humbled at the moment. Guys, yeah, think she decided to come row the boat. Doing great. We got here. When you get to Lake Flag's little island, this is it. But we're already coming back because the boat, you only have one hour and a half, not enough time to actually visit this little island. If you go up to the church, you can ring the bell yourself. So you keep hearing a bunch of ding dum ding dum from the bells of the church. He liked it. He liked ringing that bell. Some things, some things are for the men. 
I right, finally figured the correct way to row the boat. We're going so much faster now. Back at Lake Bled, we ate a burger, but my mom didn't eat. So we're gonna go to this restaurant in the center of Ljubljana called Lulia Julia. And let's see if it's good. And then we're just gonna keep shopping, going around the little center of Ljubljana. Fun fact, you have free Wi-Fi here for I think one hour, maybe more. I'm gonna put it on and then check. So we've just been shopping at the center of Ljubljana for like a whole three hours maybe. Um, I just tested a bunch of glosses. I got one of them, but I mixed everything so my lips look different. Um, so after this, we're gonna go dinner and we might do just dinner at home, make spaghetti or something. Um, but we are going to get to know the rest of Ljubljana first. We're gonna take another walk. Before we decide what we're gonna eat, we're gonna have an ice cream, which the Airbnb lady said was the best one here, and it's called Vigal also. It's Friday today, and apparently there's a food market, but it's full of people. And it's eight o'clock at night, and it's Friday, so it's supposed to be full. But there's like a lot of people. In Brazil, so the slip oil that I bought from Clarence is really expensive and like you can't find it anywhere and did I like already lose it? I then got this other thing from Clarence and I think I might have like got it, the shade oh. that I don't want. Like I, I want another shade, but I think that this shade on top of this because what is it, sweet? it comes white. Where I'm gonna have it all oh, dirty by the end. You you just get a little bit of it and you hit it on. Is it a gloss? What's going no, on? it's like a they call it lip perfector. I no idea. Said she was gonna stop commenting on my weirdness. I got this, um, whatever this is called. I have powder, you know, makeup powder from Laura Mercier. And I needed like a little thing thing because I have nothing for, for putting the powder like under my eyes. So this was great. A petite balm, which if you don't know what this is, you're missing out. This is like a remedy in France. It's actually medicine and you can only um, buy it in the pharmacy. It's like a like a butter and you can use it in your hair in your lips in your face in your body and it's literally for like hydrating really really dry spots anyways guys so yeah i didn't buy that much stuff but this is what guys, i bought today my necklace. she bought this necklace my mom got this purse um which she 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 bought it she was like i love this i love this and she she and she put it on she was like yeah i'm gonna take this it's so cheap and then she she bought it and because she was just like I bought this for you guys because I think you guys are gonna wear it more than I'm not like mom you didn't ask me if I was gonna wear it but you know what I kind of like it I think I am gonna wear it you just can't see but yeah I think I am gonna wear it I kind of like it um yeah I got a shirt for 10 euros it's nice. the, a very basic shirt that I'm going to be wearing at home I, um it's great. it's great it's great I think that's gonna be a, like a new it's great. I can't need a line. I'm so sorry, so but I feel like if it's I actually posted it, I would get out of the video. Yes, I am doing Never this come back. on purpose. purpose. This is a hard watch. <laughs> <sighs> no, here's the thing. It's not a thing, okay? Why are you talking like this? This is what you talk like when you talk your vlog. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Here's the thing. Look, and I we also got I got three of these. I got one of these, 
one of these and one of gardenia They're from zara perfumes zara anyway. perfumes but guess what in zara in brazil these cost i think at l i think literally five times what we bought right and they're like just tiny roll-ons but hold up let me say something okay Eves. i i like i do talk to the camera a little bit more friendly than i than i than i am <laughs> come off as friendly though comes off as cringe no comes off as like sometimes i'm not sometimes snobby. i'm scared i'm like i'm holding the camera in public and i'm like i'm like super serious i'm like hey guys I'm, 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 because i'm because i don't know like i'm, I'm kind of scared because everyone's i feel like everyone's watching come off as and sometimes snobby, okay? i'm like hey guys because i'm trying to entertain seem friendly, but seem friendly. Snobby, okay i come off as snobby yeah thanks for telling me the truth Okay, well, guess what? I have 20 okay. followers, and, um... I'm vlogging. And I, I don't really care. I mean, I'm not vlogging. I, I mean, I wish. Okay. It would be cool to have, like, a hundred... Not a hundred million. <laughs> to have a million followers. Eves, I am like this! You have to accept me! You're not me. like that in real life! Oh, thank God. Thank God I'm not like that in real life because that would be... Act I would not have any friends. Damn, is that why I'm, I don't have any friends? I'm not sure. The point is, I don't know what happens that I get cringier on camera. Yeah. That just happens. And this is a little announcement that says I am not this cringe in real life, according to my sister, who spends... Them, who, who spends enough time with me so so that's great news i'm not that cringy yay holy what the heck? holy cow <laughs> that was yeah. what happens in the camera what was that yay <laughs> okay well, apparently it's the camera's fault and we don't know what happens it's just a cringy attack from the camera today we are about to leave my bags aren't even here anymore, but we're about to leave and go to Croatia. Never been there before. Um, the first thing that we're gonna do tomorrow is wake up early and go to the Split Beach Par um, Natural Park. Pretty sure that's what it's called. From where we are, Ljubljana, it's only three hours from here to Split Beach, Croatia. And so it's pretty fast, pretty quick to get, so. Quick snap of how we're traveling. <laughs> The whole thing is filled and we have three bags here and I have literally a cubicle to stay in because I also have stuff there. My, oh my gosh. It's kind of a gloomy day today. Uh, we haven't left yet. We stopped at a burger called Hood Burger and it's super delicious, super delicious. I loved it. And um, right, right, right in front of it, there's a market like a shopping with a market in it, like a Target really. And my parents are there, they're gonna probably eat something there. But this, the burgers here in Slovenia are truly, I think might've been like the best burger I ate in my life or like almost, like top three, really, really good. So I recommend the burgers here. Good burger. So I did not finish the Slovenia vlog. Right after Slovenia, we went to Croatia and on our way back, we actually stopped for another night because Slovenia was one of the highlights of our Italy, Slovenia, and Croatia trip. It was one of our highlights. And so um, if you are going to Italy or you're going to Croatia for the summer, which are more popular places, you might want to give a little stop to, vi to visit Slovenia because it's just so calm, tranquil. It wasn't very full of people um, and there are lakes. It's not... It's like a warm weather, it's not cold, it's not hot. And I really recommend it, we loved it. And the food was good, the temperature was good. And um, you know, just the place was really, truly beautiful. I think that it is very similar to Austria. I think that Austria um, has like the same lake mountain vibe, but I think Austria is more well known than Slovenia and so, so Slovenia is less full of people, less crowded. Um, and so putting it out there that it was one of our highlights, it was one of the highlights of our trip. We love Slovenia 
and if you get to go i hope you can enjoy as much as we did don't forget to like and subscribe to this and my phone stopped <laughs> i hope you liked this video and don't forget to check out all the other vlogs from this trip that are already posted some that are more to come some that aren't but um don't forget to check out all the other vlogs that of this trip that are already up and some that are coming and i hope you like this video Beijo.